Okay, guys. So I, uh, I'm in a debate with um, with a few people here that think this video is real. I'm convinced it's fake. For all I know, it could be real, but I highly doubt it, especially with all the fake stuff out there on the internet today these days. But um, I found something that I think is a dead giveaway to me. Um, it's pretty convincing to me that this is fake. Um, I'll tell you what it is, and then I'll show you. It's um, when the biker comes over here this way in front of the truck. He uh, let me skip it back. When he comes over to the front of the truck here, he's got a shadow that's pointing downward, pretty much from here. Let's see, pointing downward. Now notice how, as the truck approached, the shadow didn't move at all. Um, the shadow seems to be following the light of the street lamps which would make sense they probably filmed this in a few takes and so the lighting of that shadow um, is created by the positioning of the light from the street lamps that are over here um, but according to from what I know of how light works if this truck were oncoming you'd have two sources of light and so it would create a secondary shadow that would kind of skew off um, overlapping in the middle here but have basically two shadows one coming in this direction and one coming in kind of this direction so let's watch it from here again and you'll see um, I think I have this yeah I played on slow speed so we'll watch okay and see the shadow is at this angle still at that angle and it's obviously being stretched out and contorted in a way that's unnatural once this burst of light comes over here. And there's actually not even a burst of light yet and the shadow began to stretch out. If you watch again. So no burst of light. See, still no burst of light from this entity that's coming from over here. And yet this shadow is already stretching out. And then it reappears over here. It's very well done. But I'm pr I'm positive that's got to be a fake. Let's watch it again. Okay, see, there's not even that flash of light yet, and the shadow's already stretching out. Watch it one more time on, without pausing it. Okay, you can test that yourself at home. Set up uh, an object um, and turn on a lamp, and you'll see one shadow. Like put a put a I don't know uh, a bottle of some sort on the table, and you'll see one shadow. Then shine a flashlight at it, like like headlights would be, and you'll see a secondary shadow at a different angle, which is how this should have been. Um, and shadows don't just suddenly stretch out because of a burst of light; they would, the, if that burst of light is stationary, like it is. Like, yes, it gets brighter and brighter, but it's stationary, so the shadow wouldn't stretch out. It would just become more prominent. The stretching doesn't make any sense there. So I'm convinced this has got to be a fake, not to mention it just... I mean, there's so many effects like that done in movies. There's no reason why... I, I, I honestly believe that I'd be able to do this, this video myself. So I think I'm going to go ahead and call this one bunk.